Hey everybody, my name is Sunny and this week I am going to share with you a beautiful cherry blossom wall art DIY using toilet paper rolls. It's so easy and turned out unbelievably pretty. You will need to save up some used toilet paper roll for this DIY. To form the shape of cherry blossom, press the roll flat. Then on one side, fold it back and forth at the one centimeter or half an inch point. Then open it up. Press inward at the tip to magically form a cherry blossom petal shape. Next, we are going to paint it pink. If you don't have pink acrylic color already, we are going to work some color magic and make the color pink by mixing one part red paint with three part white paint. You can of course add more red or white paint as you mix to adjust the color. By the way, you might want to lay down some pieces of paper like I did so the paint doesn't get onto your work surface. Once you have the right color, go ahead and paint the outside of the toilet paper roll. And once it's dry, paint the inside as well. Then you want to let it dry for a few hours. I just left mine to dry overnight. So the next day we are ready to cut the roll into many flower petals. I made a mark at every centimeter point and that's how thick the flower petal is going to be. You can of course make yours however wide you want it. And when you cut out each strip, you will have a flower petal. So here's what happened when I did not give it enough time to dry completely. The paint stuck to itself and it was a total disaster. I like chubby petals, so I am going to squish it a little bit so it's more round. And we are ready to make flowers. Squeeze a dab of hot glue to the bottom of the petal and gently squeeze the two petals together. Repeat the process for the next two petals. Cherry Blossom have five petals per flower and I'm going to stick to that number. But you can make mutant ones if you want. Before placing the fifth petal, remember to squeeze a dab of glue onto both sides. And there you have your cherry blossom. Repeat the process to make as many as you like. And with some double sided tape, I glued mine onto the wall and it was beautiful. I hope you enjoy this DIY. You guys are my rays of sunshine because you make me smile. Remember to subscribe for new DIY inspirations every Thursday and I will see you all next week. Stay creative!